Well, hello and welcome to Physics Games. Today's point of interest is Old Modular House and number three. This is a tier two POI and can be obtained from the trader for a clear or fetch quest. Well, we may have only done a modular house only a few videos ago. This is the first time I've reviewed one that is classified as a hillbilly trailer. And this lovely hillbilly trailer is completely and utterly um, covered around half of it, at least, with mines. So you've got to be super careful. It says stay out and they do not want you here. We got a little car. We got a closed door. We've, of course, got the uh, nice little mailbox out the front where I just get a piece of paper. And then around the other side, very recognisable, it says beware of the dog, the schneck, the pig. And a man. Well, it could be a man or a woman, but a human for sure. And again, look at this. Look, I'm almost standing on them. There's a grenade. Grenades? There are mines everywhere. And you're really forced down here if you want to get into the POI. There's no going back. Ugh, we're in. We're in. And straight away, we find bits of rubbish here and there. And I'm expecting those dogs and pigs. Oh, my God. Blimey. There we go. Straight off. Coming around somewhere. Oh my god, I missed it. Oh, that is a beast. These obviously indicate that the animals are about, but uh, wow, it's pretty damn scary. So lots of, um, any more? <laughs> and lots of um, things about here. I don't think there's much loot. This one has a little section behind it, but nothing in it. It's just, that's it really for this bottom area. Just a bit of rubbish. And there will be a dog somewhere around there so just be aware but it's all good for your rotten meat now we're coming up into the main room i'm just having a scout around in case there was something hiding there oh god don't don't make any noise rubbish oh here they come here they come um um they're bashing on something i think they may well have got stuck yeah this is good old um alpha 20 pathing of doom um, but uh, we've killed them at least. We've killed them. Around here, what do we have? We've got uh, not much. It's a tier two. So that's because the animals are so beasty in here. But there is just a bit of uh, small resources, a bit of cement, some cloth, of course. This looks like a big wall to something, but it's just another looky through into this kitchen that we're about to go into. A nice trash can, just a few resources. There's a, a door heading to the outside that was locked and then when we come in here oh don't forget this bit there's more trash this is where the dog was the dog can appear here or it could be a pig it could be a dog or a pig i think a dog there or a pig or a dog in here so a nice place to get rotten meat and meat if needed but you have to be ready for them um oh i've got a little football helmet there nothing else and a nice ammo pile here great stuff we'll have some of that then of course the standard kitchen and uh, we know these very well get into the bins get into the fridges get into the microwaves grab the pile of food if needed yep we'll have some miso soup a nice bit of an oven and uh, and of course a sink the good old sink not much for me there today there's a spoiled trash hiding in this cabinet that's more like it there's a few bits of brass and lead and then all the usual things nothing over the top there but we shall continue our journey so into this next room what have we got? I'm going to kind of stand here and have a look. Okay, we got a pig. We got a pig. Pig. Yum, 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 yum. There's a piggy in there. You got a choice. You got most well, luck. Sometimes there can be the schneck itself is uh, in there having a good kind of contemplation of life. We have uh, a little bit of trash in here. We have well, obviously the meat. I should really take that, shouldn't I? I might, might have a nibble once the stream's finished. Another sink in here and then go for the toilet gun and just get a bit of horrible water. More trash, more trash, more trash, more trash. Um, and anything behind there? Oh, more trash. Okay, once you're done with this and you've kind of had enough of all this business, then you go through here and you can just tell that this is going to be a bit of a nightmare, especially when you can see this massive, great, big, wolfy thing just there. I would advise jumping abruptly onto something because it's going to hurt very, very quickly. Um, and let's give it a go. So I come in here. I jump up here. I got a piggy over here. And I got this big boy who's going to absolutely come up here and try to chew the fudge out of me. We can now, of course, get our bow and arrow if we want, and if we're lucky like this, we can take out a little pig, eh? Like this. Hey, we got the egg! 
There, oh, just one egg. I just haven't had an egg for a couple of couple of different episodes, and I'm oh, look at the legs on this one. Look at that. It's a mutant. It's got like its head's kind of in there. It's got its two legs. It's got one coming out the side of its body, one going the other way. I just uh, do. I want to eat it. Yeah, I want to eat it. I'll eat any meat. And in here, nothing special. I would have hoped it would have pooped out an ammo pile or something. But more cement, great, and some cobblestone and stuff. It kind of makes you want to kind of come up here and follow this bit up to the roof, which you can do. But, of course, there is the official lighting in the POI saying, please come this way. So let's go the official way and kind of jump up here. And it looks like we've got more deadliness. Whoa, it's a piggy! There's more piggy! I got piggy today. Ooh, I, more piggies um, are available. Um, other brands of uh, animal uh, do exist. But there's a lot of pig in this one today. Oh gosh, you're only thinking about piggies. I love these things. Mm, nice. Uh, August must call cool sunglasses. Uh, well, not quite. You know, whatever they were. One of the many glasses in, in the game. But uh, yeah, a few little things here. And then, ooh, what have we got? We've had, we've had no schneck today, but we've had pig and dog. It's time for... Uh, human, human, human. There you. Oh, oh, yeah, human. Okay, human. Give me a tonic and a knife and nothing. Oh god. There we go. I wanted more ammo. Good. So there's a couple of ammo piles in here. We're on our third sink. Lovely. Couple of cabernet. Is that the le cabernet? And then what have we got? Uh, oh, we got a. a oh, we got we got the final loot. Okay. So let's see what we got. We got a leather trunk with some nice goodies in there. What's that one? Shotgun beside four. Craft shotgun slugs. Nice. And then we got a couple of parts and gases, which are always lovely to have. Because if you want those pass and gases, normally you're looking for a pass and a gas, aren't you? That's the kind of place. But now you know you've got a good chance in here. Look at this repair kits and all the business. More trash, of course. And then we are technically done. So it will say your quest is completed. And you can come up into the roof nice and safely and think, hmm, very nice. You know, there's more rubbish. But, of course, there is the chance for me to get redemption. Egg redemption. Give me my daily egg. Yeah. Okay, don't worry. Just, just calm, calm. Right, we have a cooler on here, and we'll grab a nice coffee. More trash, more trash, more trash. A lot of trash in this place. And then this weird little kind of cobbly seaty sitting up here, enjoying our little zoo that we've made down here. But what a nice little flat space. This could be a nice little base, couldn't it? Could be a nice little base. Once you've done this horribleness, you've uh, you're kind of done and dusted. But the sleeper volumes in here are, are below us, so you can, I do believe, and um, get yourself up to the top of here, get a nice flat area, and you don't even have to interact with the animals. And probably from up here, you can shoot a few in the head, and uh, you've got a bit of protection around. They already mined. So what a place to maybe start a little base. But can we cheese the final loot? Oh, boink. I bet you we can. In day one, a cheesy mode. Right, let's do this. We're going to go and cheese the heck out. This is, this is not even the right POI. Um, okay. Here we are in day one mode. We are in game stage one, level one. And our loot stage is one. What kind of gorgeousness are we going to get here? Well, I'm going to get a little booky. A little book, as per usual, out the front. And then we're going to come around the side. And it's going to say, of course, uh, beware dog, schneck, pig, and man. And we're just going to stand here, and we're going to start hitting the uh, the bit below the m for man. Yeah, we made it all the way through, and look at that. I can just grab this, and look at all this gorgeousness that we're getting out. Mining volume 4, super strong coffee time, and I need to cite mod 2, 23 bullets. Like, thank you very much. Well, we're done and dusted, I suppose. If you want more, then you have to go to the... Well, you can go above the M, and you can also go a uh, 2 to the side of the N. And again, we'll just keep hitting. But as you'll see, I'll need to get some rocks because I'm going to break my axe. There we go. We'll just go and grab this little bad boy here. And uh, I will bash on through right there. And uh, let's see what's on the other side. Here we go. Just running out of stamina there. Not a pass and gas today. But we got a Savage Country uh, little box there. So we're just going to bash on through this one. 
And yum, 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 yum. Let's get our freebies for the day. Oh, a pair of jeans. Not too great. If you do break on through, you'll have to get another rock and break on through this one. Then you'll see if there is a another little box there. And we shall uh, just simply frame on up here. And we'll break on through this. And we'll get some more goodies too. And then we've done them all. We haven't interacted with any zombies. We haven't done anything of the sort. And we have just cheesed the heck out of this place. <laughs> okay, maybe don't worry about them at all. But there we are. Let's continue onto the roof if we were to um, get up here. And I promise you there will never be a zombie up here. And uh, there will be nothing. As long as you do not encroach into the spaces below you. You're not going to wake anything up. You can see that uh, I don't think you'll even see the actual things appear. So they're not even going to appear there. There's no, there's, there's nothing at all. The old spawn itself is going to happen when you are a little bit lower. I think I can probably put a little, can I put a little block on here somewhere? Come on, give me a little block. Oh, there you go. There you go. See that guy spawn there? That's uh, what they're going to do. I tried to do that gracefully and failed horrendously. So you're not even going to see a little doggy. You're not going to even see a, a little schneck. You're going to see nothing of the sort down there. You're just going to use this area and you can safely sit up here knowing you're safe from some zombies from all these lovely mines that are around the side, which is pretty good. So what a lovely little P.O.Y. that is. Pretty damn easy cheese. Let's get the cheese on my out. It's a lot of hitting, isn't it? I'll go and get my little frames back, shall we? Yeah, it's quite nice. Thank you very much. Um, it's a classic P.O.Y. It looks scary, but I don't think it's too bad, to be fair. You'll probably need a gun or, a, you know, if you're, if you're early days or something. Uh, be very careful. Hello, local. You all right, local? What are you doing? Oh, please, walk into that. Walk into this. Oh, oh, please, please. Hang on. Hang on. Let me just come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, they're all getting annoyed. The dogs and everything. So let's give this on the cheeseometer. Something along the line of, well, I don't know. That's pretty damn simple. I know it's a lot of hitting, but it's a good four out of four. And if you are ever here ready for your quests, you're going to see a big exclamation mark bouncing up and down here. And you know, just by hitting the letter under the M, you can get a quick bit of loot before you actually do the quest. How beautiful is that? Well, we're going to go high up into the sky and this is the beautiful physics playground videos three times a week i need you to hit all the buttons you know what it's like and uh you've got live streaming we got tips and tricks you know we've only got a few things going on down here check out some of my other videos and i will see you very soon goodbye <laughs> can we run across <laughs> No, no, you can't. No. No.